Hi, my name is Patrick. I'm master distiller at Sloan's Gin. What makes Sloan's Gin different from other gins is that it's basically made in a different way. We use about nine botanicals. Every botanical gets distilled separately and we get the best flavor and aromas from every botanical. We use fresh fruit, oranges and lemons from Murcia in Spain because the fresh fruit has got the richest, freshest flavor instead of the dried peel that everybody else is using. Now, if you take an orange and you smell the peel of it, you'll see that it has a rich, fresh smell, which is totally different from the oxidized smell that you get from dried peel. And if you smell the gin, you will really see the reason why we do this, because the Sloan's gin smells of this lovely, fresh citrus fruit. We use nine botanicals, all individually distilled, like these wonderful vanilla pots. Vanilla, of course, is a very expensive ingredient. But this is vanilla from Madagascar that we distill and use to bind all the flavors of the other botanicals. So, this here is the still that we use for Sloan's gin. As you can see, it's quite a modern still. So it's a, it's a copper pot still. It's got a stainless steel water bath. So the, the water bath heats the still quite gently. So you get a really nice and gentle distillation. If you look inside the still, you'll see that it's all copper. That's very important for the flavor of the distillate. And also you'll see that it's a big agitator inside to keep all these lovely fresh fruits from sticking to the bottom of the still. So what we do is we buy fresh lemons from Murcia in Spain. We cut them by hand, put them in our little still, then add neutral grain spirit. Then, of course, you have to close it, otherwise it doesn't work. And then you gently heat. The alcohol will evaporate, go up, go over this here, come into this stainless steel cooler, where it will be gently cooled down to condensation temperature and it will run out of here. So after the distillation, we rest every distillate separately for at least two to three months. After this resting period, we blend them all together and then they are rested again so that all the individual flavors can marry together into one lovely gentle fold. This is quite a small still for distilling gin. You'll see the typical still that they use for London dry gin is much bigger than this one. And that is because people usually put all the botanicals in one big still until they're all bland and overcooked. Of course, this method is more time consuming and more complicated than what we traditionally do. But having won the world's best gin makes it worth it. We hope you enjoy drinking Sloan's gin as much as we enjoy making it for you.